Hello everyone, we're very optimistic about NVIDIA. We bought it cheap when it hit almost $100 in the fourth quarter of last year, and it tripled in value, just like some of our other AI-focused stocks. Standard still, NVIDIA is trading at 25 times sales, and Tesla, which is likely the biggest AI story out there, is trading at six times sales. UPPath reported yesterday that Tesla is also trading at six times sales, and it is a beautiful AI play. That's right. Kathy Wood is selling some of her NVIDIA shares. She's done this before, even though NVIDIA has been one of her almost favorite stocks. Autonomous driving is the biggest AI project in the world, and Tesla is clearly the leader in that. So why would Kathy Wood choose to reduce her holdings in NVIDIA, a company that has shown a lot of market growth and technological innovation? And why would she increase her investment in Tesla at this point? We'll look at the main reasons for this change, including how much NVIDIA and Tesla are worth compared to each other, the expected growth paths of both companies, and how advances in AI and self-driving technologies are changing the investment environment. We will learn a lot about ARK Invest's strategic moves in this film. They were led by the visionary Kathy Wood. We will talk about the most important reasons why the company chose to change its investment strategy. Focus on companies like NVIDIA, which has been a leader in the GPU market for a long time, and Tesla, which is a trailblazer in AI and self-driving cars. We'll also look at how the market as a whole works and how ARK's investment plan fits with future technological trends. Our goal is to help you fully understand these changes and what they might mean for the future of technology. Before we go any further, though, don't forget to hit the like and subscribe keys. Hello! and welcome to Tesla Stock News. Let's begin this movie. Kathy Wood, CEO of ARK Invest, recently made headlines in the investment community when she decided to sell a large portion of the company's shares in NVIDIA, which has been one of the best performers on the 2024 stock market. In an in-depth interview with Benzinga, Wood talked about her decision, pointing out factors such as the current a high price for NVIDIA's stock, concerns about its liquidity, and possible future investments in the AI sector led us to believe that NVIDIA was still in the more focused portfolio at a lower percentage. Now we're on to the next big AI beneficiaries. In my opinion, recent advances in AI are helping Tesla get closer to its goal. With its own data and business knowledge, along with AI skills, Tesla can become more competitive in its own field. Our Invest has worked with NVIDIA since the start of the investment company in 2014, which was the start of a very important relationship. At that time, RK started buying NVIDIA shares for about $5 each, which is a low entry point by today's standards. At first, NVIDIA was mostly known for making PC game chips, an area where it was already making big progress. However, Our Invest saw a future under the leadership's imaginative direction. They thought that NVIDIA's graphics processing units would be very important in the new field of artificial intelligence. This strategic understanding of how NVIDIA's technology could be used in AI set ARC invest up to profit from the coming technological shift. Their foresight paid off as NVIDIA quickly changed its focus and became a major player in the AI technology space. The bus were originally designed to handle complex video game graphics. Graphics were perfect for the parallel processing needs of AI computations. As AI technologies grew, so did NVIDIA's market value and influence, making it a top performer in several of ARK's investment portfolios. Today, NVIDIA is the fourth largest returning stock in RK Invest's flagship portfolio, showing how successful ARK's early and ongoing investments in the company were. This placement shows not only the rise in NVIDIA stock price, but also RK's strategic foresight in spotting and capitalizing on new technological trends as they were still developing. NVIDIA is a great example of how deep business knowledge and smart investment can pay off big. Adopting NVIDIA as a key part of ARK's tech industry success story, even though NVIDIA has had a lot of success and played a big part in ARK's successes, would raise concerns about its current trading valuation, which she thinks is too high at 25 times revenue. While ARK continues to hold NVIDIA in its AI-focused portfolios, Wood is still worried about NVIDIA's heavy reliance on hardware. Even though the company is expanding into software, Wood also thinks that there could be an inventory glut because of all the excitement around AI. 
though the exact timing is still unknown. This cautious stance is part of ARC's larger plan to diversify its investments by focusing more on companies with strong software capabilities that offer better long-term growth opportunities than hardware-centric firms, according to her analysis. Kathy Wood drawn attention to the valuation measures of a number of AI-related companies, such as Twilio, Lipeth, and Tesla, which trade at much lower revenue multiples than NVIDIA. This is mostly because their focus is on software rather than hardware. Wood stresses the idea of software pull, which means that using AI hardware can make more people want and pay more for related software services and solutions. She thought that this pull through could generate 8 to 20 times more sales for software focused businesses. This metric shows the huge market potential for software driven AI solutions. It suggests that as AI technology improves, the real value may not just be in the hardware, but also in the software that makes the hardware better and uses AI's powers. This view not only shows how important software is for growing AI applications, but it also hints at why RK Invest might find a better long-term growth path in businesses that use software to make the most of their AI technology. Wood's focus on these dynamics marks a shift in his investment philosophy toward companies that stand to gain the most from software advances in AI. The timing of Arc's Invest's decision to sell NVIDIA shares has caused a lot of debate among analysts. Some say the move may have been made too soon, causing Arc to miss out on big future gains due to NVIDIA's ongoing innovations and strong market momentum. This worry comes from the thought that tens of millions of dollars in income might have been lost. Kathy Wood's choice, on the other hand, is part of a larger plan to balance short-term profits with long-term security growth. Her method stresses how important it is to look at more than just how a stock is doing in the market right now. You should also think about what the market might do in the future and how it works in general. This decision has shown how complicated investment strategies can be, especially in fields that change quickly, like artificial intelligence. Now, let's talk about the latest news about Tesla. Over the past five years, NVIDIA's stock value has gone up a lot. This is mostly because more people want to buy their hardware for training AI, which was helped a lot by one of their biggest customers. But even though Tesla is mostly known for making cars, its big financial promises are in line with its bigger goals in AI and self-driving technology. Tesla has been very focused on being at the forefront of developing self-driving cars. Their ambitious project, the Dojo Supercomputer, which is meant to train AI models, shows how committed they are to this goal. Dojo is an important step toward making Tesla's self-driving skills better. The newest version of Tesla's full self-driving software includes an end-to-end -end generated AI model. This model is a huge step forward in automotive technology because it lets Tesla's system directly learn from video data taken during real driving scenarios. By analyzing this data, the system can figure out complicated driving patterns, find the best routes, and make choices about real-time driving with a level of accuracy that has never been seen before. This feature isn't just about automating driving jobs. It's also about making a very flexible learning system that can keep getting better as it comes across new information, new situations on the road, thanks to this cutting-edge tech. Tesla, at the cutting edge of developing self-driving cars, could change the future of transportation. Vidya's CEO has praised Tesla's innovative work in pushing the limits of self-driving technology. He sees a future where all cars on the road could be driven by AI technologies, similar to Tesla's. How hard and how much training is needed for such advanced AI models need a lot of computing power, which is why Tesla is putting a lot of money into this area in 2024. It's clear that Tesla wants to improve its technology, as shown by its ambitious spending decision. The company plans to spend about $1 billion on AI training and inference, as the fields of autonomous cars and AI technology in general continue to change quickly. This large investment shows how important it is to stay ahead of the curve. This investment isn't just about staying ahead of the curve. It's about shaping the future of mobility. Focusing on improving its AI is what Tesla is doing, central to the company's plan to lead the way to fully autonomous driving. Its investment supports a wide range of activities, from improving the neural networks that process the huge amounts of data gathered from Tesla's global fleet to refining the algorithms that control autonomous behaviors.
It's amazing how much video data is needed to train these AI models. Every Tesla vehicle with sensors and cameras acts as a data collection device. At each point, detailed visual information about the driving environment is collected. This information is then used to teach AI systems how to recognize objects, make choices, and learn from real-life situations, which takes a huge amount of computing power. In addition, the money spent on AI training and reasoning includes a lot of money for hardware and software. High-performance GPUs, a lot of data storage space, and advanced software tools are needed to process this data efficiently. These resources are important not only for training accurate and reliable AI models, but also for keeping them up to date and better as more data comes in. Overall, Tesla's big investments and the resulting demand for high-performance AI training hardware have been key factors in the rise of NVIDIA's stock. The changing landscape of AI and autonomous driving continues to create lucrative opportunities for companies like NVIDIA that are at the forefront of providing the necessary technological infrastructure. Now, how will NVIDIA's strategic changes affect its future growth, especially since it is shifting from hardware-centric operations to more software-centric ones? What might the long-term effects be for AR's business now that it's no longer working with NVIDIA? How does Tesla's continued investment in AI training prepare the company to be a leader in self-driving technologies? We'd love to hear your thoughts and ideas on these topics in the comments section below. Also, don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful and subscribe to Tesla Stock News for more news. Thanks for watching, and we look forward to having more interesting conversations with you in our next videos.